To a developing story now out of Kalamazoo, a man is in jail after police say he stabbed and killed his wife. New tonight, we're hearing from neighbors about the family. News 8's Jacqueline Francis has the latest from Kalamazoo Township. Neighbors are still in shock tonight, saying they were woken up by police sirens around 1.30 this morning, never guessing something like this could have happened. The police officer knocked on my door, and then he asked if um, I had seen or heard anything. It was the wake-up call the Westwood neighborhood wasn't expecting. Police officers canvassing the area. He said there wasn't any fire or gas leak, so I was not sure what was going on. Just a few doors down, tragedy had struck. Kalamazoo Township police say a man stabbed and killed his wife around 1.30 Sunday morning at their home in the 700 block of Campbell Avenue. Police say the wife, a 37-year-old woman, was rushed to the hospital where she died from her injuries. According to investigators, her husband, a 43-year-old man, took off from the scene and was later found and arrested in Berrien County. Neighbors who didn't want to show their face on camera said the family had moved into the neighborhood more than a decade ago. Telling News 8, both parents worked a lot, so they didn't see much of them. But their kids, two boys and a girl, were often seen playing in the neighborhood. My heart hurts so much for the family and the kids. Um, we've lived here almost 30 years and something like this has never happened. Police say the kids are now in the care of other family members. No names have been released at this time, though police say the husband is currently being held at the Kalamazoo County Jail. Anyone with information about what happened is asked to call police or silent observer. Reporting in Kalamazoo Township, Jacqueline Francis, News 8.